everybody, and welcome to Strange Lands. We're playing GeoGuessr. We got Alzareth here. Hello. Talk us the villain. I really want to remix like the, the hello everybody, like hello everybody, hello everybody, hello everybody, hello everybody. And Huerta. Hello. And we are playing uh, GeoGuessr. Mr. Peter Bread is the weekly champion. Once again, 24,629 points. Nice. That's like... That's I think that is the single best score we've we've seen so far in this type of challenge. He even commented on like I think it was to second guess that um that he just guessed. Even his guesses are better than ours. <laughs> it's sad. All right, time to dethrone him though. While in uh Nighty's absence here, you have an opportunity to dethrone Mr. Beer to bread. And as usual, the link will be in the description below. Uh play along with us. You want to share your score? You can do that in the comments, or you can put them over in the GeoGuessr subreddit. Is everybody ready? Firm. Yep. Indeed. All right. Three, two, one, go. It's like it's just like it's so musical, you know. The hello everybody, hello everybody, hello 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 everybody. Now we'll, we'll look around. Okay, there's nothing that way. Um, looks like we're in America. Death. Um, could be in Europe. So we have the, the two yellow lines in the middle of the road. That's like an American thing, right? Yeah, we're in... I think we're in freedom. It's so exciting. I mean, yeah. You free. Uh, black and dog pound. Well, that's uh, a nice place. Um, I don't know what that is. Um, I should be tired, and yet... For some reason I am. Uh, yes, yesterday, uh, Weirt and I uh, skyped for six hours, six and a half hours. Uh, Weirt was wandering around Oddport, and well, not Oddport, the various environs, and I was. We were all reminiscing about all the fun times we had, taking pictures of Baron Nimrath. It's, it's all good. Um. This could be Canada. Uh, let's start thinking about where this could be. There's a lot of uh, pine trees. Um, could be Pacific Northwest or Montana. Or I don't think it's Canada though. Um, I feel like I'm not on a road that I should be going on, but where do I really want to go? Come on, come on, come on, back over the road. We'll just look at this sign and hope that this sign is... Where? Where? What? Oh, okay. Um, County Jail. Baptist Church. County something. Okay. Nah! Ah! Ah! Oh, okay. Let's just... I'll, I guess there. Um, oops. Oh. Mississippi, for real? I don't know. Was, was it loading slowly for you guys? Yeah. All right, so it's not just me. I don't know if it was loading slowly for them, but... It was loading okay for me. I think Maybe... it was a bit slow for me, yeah. It must be a southern thing. Maybe there's been a, a serious Texas issue. Hey, lo like looking at the map, pipeline. like, Texas isn't directly to the south of Indiana. I always thought that Texas was. Huh, that's weird. No, it, 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 it's, <laughs> it's, it's... It's on the wrong side of the, of the river, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and you All keep right. calling me a South Ron. Well, you are. You're South Ron. It's not fair. And you said Arizona was definitely South Ron, but according to your description of things and angles, uh, I should be a West Ron. Fine, Alzarath, you can be a West Ron. So anyways, <laughs> uh, I couldn't really find anything um, around there other than it was most likely the U.S. Um, they had recycling, so I'm like, well, I'll go with a more progressive state. I went with Massachusetts, and I was very wrong and got 1703. How about you, Al? I guessed in Missouri and got 3905, but I guessed there because, frankly, as I was going around, I said, okay, this looks like Podunk, USA. There's church. There's stuff like that. The houses looked very kind of like central, southeastern looking to me because they were a lot, I don't really know how to describe it, flatter, whereas the ones in the northeast are a little bit more vertical as the ones are in the left a little bit more vertical because you have more people there. But... Uh, at the very last minute, I was like, it doesn't look very mountainous, so I sh should probably move more towards Kansas. So I moved it from kind of like, I was thinking possibly down in Georgia or South Carolina over into Missouri, and yeah, 3905. Talk us. 
Well, I thought it looked a lot more northern than the 12th. I just went with North Dakota, Minnesota, E, and got 1, 4, 1, 5. Berta? Colorado, 1485. I just got, like, it looked U.S., and that was the only thing that, yeah, worked. Actually, Col Colorado wouldn't have been a bad guess. Uh, either is Minnesota. It, it looks it looked like a lot of America, quite frankly. Yeah, right you just take a big L out of America and you've got <laughs> anywhere in there it could be. <laughs> All right, next one. You guys ready? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Three, two, one, go. If you don't close press push stuff, you can't hear it all good. Amazingly enough, um, we're in a place. That was, I, th I, I thought that there were two seconds left and panicked. Um, eh, well, I mean, I would never have guessed, guessed Mississippi, so. But well, um, a cactus. Is this a cactus? This is some Guaro cactus thing. Wow. That's like Arizona, right? Are we in Arizona? We can go visit Kurt. Yay, Kurt! Um. Yep. Well, this is very. I don't know. It's very. There's a dude. Hello. I guess I should see if they're. I guess this is probably Mexico, since I think I'll choose um sort of Arizona-ish, but over the border in Mexico, because I mean I don't think that imagine that the cacti are confined to northern tech uh, Mexico. What's this? That's well. Hello, well. I know, could this be Europe? Think about places in Europe that this could be. Are there cacti in Spain? I don't think so. There, I mean, there's a, there's a giant planty thing, which would... I mean, you know, there are plants on the... A lot of plants on the Mexican side of the border. These cars look, uh, freedom-ish. They, they look like they've been, uh... They're not enslaved, subjugated. Yeah, that looks like a cool place to be. Um, Chihuahua. I remember when I was in fifth grade, I had a song that went like, Chewy, Chihuahua. Oh, thank you, thanks. All right, well, um, Sun was a little to the south. Uh, looked very Mexican to me, I guessed in uh, a little bit northern, central northern Mexico, 4153, how'd you do, well? I guessed a lot further north in Mexico. Um, it looked Mexican to me, and it looked more like kind of like Arizona kind of terrain. So I guessed up near Sonora and Chihuahua, and I got 2210. Talk us. I was the same as all the rest, 2527. And Huerta. I totally forgot that Mexico was a thing. And I guess <laughs> Romania and got three points. <laughs> Oh no! Dun, dun, now, dun. now when I see, now when I see the actual location, I'm like, yeah, that makes sense. But like, I totally forgot that Mexico was a place. <laughs> the cacti of Romania. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm right, tired. Um, someone's Probably. gonna have to send uh, to the Romania thing. Someone's gonna have to send a uh, cactus to um, oh, what's his name? He's Minecracker, the old man, Willikers. <laughs> He's what? in Romania? Isn't he in Romania? Or what, uh, where did he move? Bulgaria well, or Romania? Ge no, generic B is in, somebody else was in Romania. Yeah, Generic B is in Bulgaria. Oh, Generic B? I, uh, he's okay. in Bulgaria. There you go. I don't think that. Old Man Real Walker. It's the same difference. I mean, I Rob. It's the same country, even. But Rob isn't it's part probably. of Minecraft, remember? Because my, no. Rob and Good have like the, the, the tension thingy, you know? Uh, Over anyways, next round. Yes, yeah. next round. Yes, next round. 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> I, I know my mind crack lore. A, I, I, I feast on drama like a wolf sucking meat from a hound. Apparently. Um, I feast on drama like a wolf sucking meat from a hound. That's a description. Um, I feel like we're... I should be moving places that I'm not. Um, I'm just gonna like go along this road. 
Let's do the uh, the we. Come on, come on, come on. It's okay. I believe. I believe in miracles, Neil. That you free. Are you ready? Ready? Are you ready? Ready? Are you ready for a mirror? When when the uh, when the direction. Okay. Um. This place is going to seem really obvious when I uh, find out where it is. Come on. This is not very good. Okay, so what we have? We have deciduous trees. We have a, a car down the road that looks, I guess, sort of European. Um, I'm not going to guess America. I guess, maybe I'll guess... I, I should guess America. This doesn't look like... I don't know who this is. I'm, I'm guessing, like, the Romania, I guess, and... In solidarity with the, the Finn, I there's nothing to go on. Like if I knew, like it's like it's not. This doesn't look like Scotland. Ah, um, if this ends up being in, uh, if this ends up being in uh, Romania, then I'm we, we, oh, so we can move now. Oh, is, is, are we? Oh, oh, well, well. So now we can move. It's, uh... Well, how about that? Uh, a second one in Mexico. I could not get away from that damn truck. Yeah, I couldn't get away either. It was some kind of loop. I don't know what was going on with that. Anyway, I guessed Pennsylvania. I failed 501. How'd you do, Al? I guessed in kind of like South Central Sonora and got uh, 1710. Falcus. Guessed in the Hoosier Fatherland, got 748. Where to? Uh, New Mexico, 1258. All right, next round. You guys ready? Yeah. Yep. Yes. Hopefully we can escape from trucks this time. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. I should have known that it was more dry than Mexico. Oh, well. Um, Evie Brand. Evie Brand. Evie Brand. Um... Hmm. Just thinking. Uh, random thought for the day is that I'd rather be uh, someone that a few people hate and a few people love than have someone that everyone sort of gets along with. That's uh, Inuit um, ish thingy. Um, because I'd rather have. Uh, it's better to have one. I'd rather ha well, have like one dedicated viewer than like ten sort of. Or, well, like five, really. Not ratio than that. I like meh viewers. It's like, um, if I had, I'm, right now I'm at, uh, 78 subscribers. That's it this morning, actually. Uh, go me. And, um, I would, it's like I would rather, uh, lose, you know, 10 subscribers randomly than have, uh, Weirta not be able to comment again, or whatever again, because Weirta is, you know, worth 10 subscribers, because, well, you know, all the uh, happyfulness that she does for the channel in terms of viewing. Like, that's not to, I like, but I just, random thoughts, me. Um, I don't mean to uh, diss anyone. I, everything is love. Um, but yeah, that that is what I was thinking. I, I should probably, like, think more about, like, the game that I'm playing. Is this Mexico again? I think this is Mexico again. Um, although, wasn't it Inuit that I just saw? I don't know. I'm guessing Canada. Watch this be... Wait, this, we're, going, we're guessing like Saskatchewan. I think there's a lot of... Um, Ebr oh, okay. Well, uh, um... I what wasn't the sure... Hell? <laughs> I wasn't sure between South Africa and Australia. I was sticking with Australia until I eventually found a sign for Humansdorp, I think it was. There it is, Humansdorp to the east. And to the west was, I don't remember. Anyways, I went with South Africa, got 4505. How'd you do, Al? I saw a double A on a sign. I got four points. <laughs> That hurts. How about you, Talkus? Um, so are you a Westron fixer? Or you, you're a Southron? I'm a Northron. You, no, you aren't a Northerner. You don't come from the North. Yes, he is. 
No, no. I spent a majority of my life in the north. Well, I spent and a I spent a majority of my life, of my life in, Indiana, in the west, and I'm a Hoosier. So, so okay, fine. You get to be a Southron, okay? You're, in you're fact, Tulkis, to me, you're the Southron. No, no, yes. no. Indiana is you. You're everything south is where oriented I grew up. according to Indiana because Indiana is the center of the world, and Indianapolis is the center of Indiana, and I am the center of Indianapolis. And the I saw language on the sign that looked uh, Inuit. And so I guessed in uh, Canada and got zero points. Um, How did you do that? <laughs> wow, I thought I was going to get the lowest score. <laughs> Holy beat goodness. you on that one. <laughs> I beat you by four, Tolkien. Well, by four points. Apparently Dutch Afrikaans look like Canadian Inuit. I don't even know. I'm not sure we've had a bigger discrepancy than, than guessing Canada from uh, South Africa. I guess That's Europe. Good. Yeah, guess. Well, it's, it's like I I I saw that the train looked Mexican, so I was gonna guess Mexico, but like they're like these are like like, like, like 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 Saskatchewan or something. It's like, yeah. How'd you do, Erta? I guessed in the middle of South Africa and got thirty-seven twenty-nine. Uh, they were driving on their left and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I have no idea how you get Canada from that, but okay. <laughs> I've next, done worse. Next round, you guys ready? Yeah. No. Yes. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Man, that was. Uh, I feel dumb. Um, well, this is going to be my. Oh, Patrick Hatter. That's uh, helpful. Um, Depenure, is that the name of a town? I'm not going to. get. I think it's not the name of the town. Um, go over here. Um. So, yeah, the, everyone needs to have a one fail guess, I guess, and this is it. Uh, oh, so the, the, can, the Canadian flag means that this is the great national road of nationalness. Um, so two, two, eight, seven, two, eight, seven. At least we can get this guess right, hopefully. Come on. I believe in miracle. You'll set you free. Are you ready? Ready? Are you ready? Ready? Are you ready for a miracle? I believe in miracles, and he'll set you free. I don't see the the thing. Um, where is Mont Car Caramel? Mont Caramel. Um, this could be to the northern near Lish. Le Dauphin, uh, Saint Denis, and Mont Caramel and Le Philippe. Something. 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 Um, what about up, up north? Is there anything up here? Um, why does... Why don't I see the place where we are? Um, should I guess near the uh, border with uh, Alaska? I don't even know what I should do. Oh... Yes, too many. I don't. It looks too populated to be northerny, so I'll just go with uh, sort of that bit of on it. We'll go with. Yeah. I was at the last moment I was going to guess Quebec, but I didn't. So I just screwed up. I had my guess by Quebec City, and at the last second, I changed it to St. Pierre. You saw the same sign I did. Yes. <laughs> and I didn't realize, I didn't know where that was. And then I see St. Pierre, and I'm like, oh, yeah, there we go. And, I mean, last second I changed it, so that was a fail. Um, 2434, how'd you do, Al? I was looking, I, I think I found the same sign you did. Uh, the St. Uh, Jean Port, not St. Jean Port Jolie, um, Mont Carmel, or one. Yes, Mount it had Carmel. like a saint one on it. So I'm looking around for cities that are saint. I'm thinking, okay, this is going to be East Coast because that's where most of the U.S. saint ones are. So it's going to be on the East for Canada usually too. Um, ended up kind of hopping around in Quebec and East. Uh, ended up putting it kind of close where you put yours, and I moved it to the west to hedge my bets. <laughs> if you zoom <laughs> While in, while looking for the road number. Look at all these cities. If you zoom in, Saint Pascal, Carmel. Yeah, it's very saint. Usually, the East does have that kind of religious 
kind of naming theme to it for some reason. I don't know why. Just the times well, like whenever it was French settled. Mis- well, like French missionaries and stuff, you know. Yeah, but I got 2733. All right, talk us. At the very last moment, I thought I decided that the names looked uh, Quebecois. Is that the way Quebecois? Well, and, um, but I didn't change my guess in time, so I guessed Ontario. Go 1796. And we're talking. Ontario, 2010 points. All right, let's check out our summaries. I got this 13, will be 000. horrible. Yeah, I got 13,296. How'd you do, Al? I hate the Scandinavian guess I made, which is the South Africa one. <laughs> yeah. Other, I got 10,562. So oh I just realized my music stopped in the midpoint of that somewhere. Talk is 6,486. Nice. Where to? 8,485. Hey, weird to beat me, yay! I haven't been last in quite some time. As a group, that was a pretty pathetic outing we had there. Yeah. As an individual, that was a pretty pathetic outing. To my defense, though, there were none of the... None of them were in Europe, so... Well, the language yeah. looked into it! <laughs> It's, it's not. Well, it's like how, it's like all these Inuit things. It's like it's like 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 Irvuk and Alavik and Ranger Station. Well, that's and to you walk you think, isn't it? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> if you guys play along, put your score in the comments below or over in the GeoGuessr subreddit and all that jazz. We'll see who the new or returning weekly champion is. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. South, Bye. South, Bye. South Ron. I'm a Westron for most of my life. I've been all over the Westron yeah, area. Yeah, no, I know. You're, you're a Westron. If you're in Western Texas, and I presume you are, then you are a Westron. And I guess if Fixer is in Southern, Eastern Texas, then he's a Southron. You know? Al's in Northern Texas. Yeah. Oh, he's still a... Uh, well, with... Uh, y'all are hopeless. I'm in the DFW area. You just... And if you, if you were to split Texas in half, right down the middle... Al would be considered Eastern. <laughs> but I, so wait, so he's like Dallas. Dallas Fort Worth area, yeah. I don't. Oh, uh, so Fort Worth. My, this is right on the line. Um, yeah, I guess it looks like you are a uh, a Western. Congrats, Al. Um, <laughs> yeah, congrats. Bye, everyone. <laughs>